Good morning everyone, it's Nuno here and today I would like to talk about performance improvements on Laravel and more precisely because in the last two weeks I think um, I've been working on kind of improving the performance of um, certain features in Laravel and the first one was actually the test suite, which I was able to make the test suite in Laravel actually consume kind of 50% less memory at scale. And right now I'm working on making Blade components a lot faster. And a question that comes up often to me, especially on Twitter DMs, is how I'm able to find those performance improvements. And today I would like to talk a little bit about how that happens behind the scenes. Well, the first thing is obviously the report that comes from the community about a particular feature that is slow. And that often happens on GitHub issues or I often also see a pattern on Twitter. Usually when we identify that a particular feature needs to be improvement, uh, improved uh, performance-wise, um, I start this task locally, which is try to identify why that particular feature is so slow. And for that, I would like to recommend you a feature of Xdebug that I usually use uh, often, which is the profile mode. Um, this particular feature of FXDebug is actually super simple to use, so often I place the code that is slow on my routes console.php under a command uh, route closure. And once I do that, I execute the code using this XDebug profile mode, and that generates me a cache green file which is uh, this file who that who does have this format that can be read by um, by a new UI later and for macOS I actually have this qcache green application which I'm going to share later on the notes of this audio format and it's basically this application that I can open and then within that application I can open that file generated by xdebug. So once I open the application, I open, I import the file in it and this UI will basically tell me where does the code spend most of its time. Uh, so if I have a code which has like three functions A, B and C and if like 80% of the time my code is like spend on a function C, probably I can make an improvement on the function C. So it's as simple as that. Um, this cache green way of debugging why your code is slow, it's basically the way I use to find these performance improvements on the framework. Now, usually why a, co a particular code is slow, it can be related to two, th two things. Um, the first one is that the code is just doing too much and on that case you need to find ways of having that particular piece of code doing less or using less resources. The second thing that can make a particular piece of code slow is uh, because it's leaking memory and in fact the first uh, improvement of the framework that I have made regarding performance improvements was related to a memory leak on PHP unit itself. So once I have fixed that memory leak, um, the code just becomes a lot, lot faster. And yeah, that's, that's the way I use to sometimes improve a particular feature on the framework performance wise. And I hope you guys like this audio.